Dante Bell entered court without any criminal history, but now he's alleged to have brought the gun to campus that caused so much chaos at Oakland High School on Monday. Our deputy prosecutor recommended $100,000 bail because of the potential danger to the community. A 17-year-old student there also faces serious charges for his alleged role. Police say that student accidentally fired the gun inside a boy's bathroom. The bullet narrowly missed another student, and the gunfire sent police scrambling and sent the school into lockdown. There is nothing more important than protecting our children. We want our schools to be safe, and especially in this environment, people need to be this vigilant. On, today on Monday, several more Pierce County teenage students faced a judge for their alleged role in online threats of violence that caused even more chaos and fear at two more South Sound schools. That's why prosecutors build the cases they can to hold students accountable when they cause serious disruptions. And as for schools... Districts are saying we can invest on preventative things, but the legislature has to step up and help. The state superintendent of public instruction says a number of kids across Washington sometimes suffer from mental health problems, which can be a contributing factor to some threats. But he insists arming public school teachers is not a smart way to solve the problem. There's no evidence that we can find anywhere in the literature that says arming teachers is an effective deterrent or an effective intervention. Now that adult student that was charged this afternoon